Um, I think it just like depends. Like the American dream affects where you live. Like if you want to follow the American dream, you come to America versus stay in your like home country. Being able to do whatever you want is crucial to the American dream. I would say reaching for your potential, uh, having goals and dreams. Hopefully uh, taking chances and uh, realizing your dreams. Being free to have an education and to find a job that you enjoy and to own your own home and to find someone you love to spend your life with. For me, American dream is uh, if you are willing to work hard, you know, you can pretty much achieve anything you want. I think that it is not as much of a reality as it is a dream, um, certainly. I think that the idea that that, the, the concept of that possibility is um, a really interesting like it, it, it's, it's really nice that that exists as a concept, but sometimes um, because it exists as a concept, people might blame the individual for not achieving success. With many different standards for evaluating success, success in the modern world can only be as one, one self defines it. As long as one takes pleasure in being whoever they are, being comfortable with themselves, that is the only way one can achieve success. My family, uh, my grandparents, didn't have a high school education, so they always taught me that the American dream was to go to college and get you know, a, a college degree. And so I always kind of felt that you know, going back to school was pretty important. I just started a second master's degree myself, so. I grew up in poverty and ignorance in a little town in Texas with, where most people only had a third or fourth grade education. No one owned their own homes except one big farmer. And from that, I've grown into be an independent person who has traveled all over America and in foreign countries. And I do have my own home. And uh, I had my American dream, and I've enjoyed it. My family, they weren't born here. They were born in Hong Kong, Malaysia, and they came here during college to pursue an education. So I'm here because my parents kind of pursued that American dream, new opportunity, new jobs and everything. So, and myself, I really see the American dream because I'm free to pursue whatever I want. Like, I want to major in bio in college, and that's like the, like, I guess, what the American dream is, like being able to choose what you want to do. No, I think America, you know, besides uh, what America stands for, you, know, you work hard, you can achieve anything. The whole society, the, the Constitution really supports that. Besides that, the freedom that the Constitution guarantees and that America really supports, you know, freedom to express yourself, freedom, even if it's contrary to popular belief, you can choose to stand up or not stand up. That's really something I think it's very, very powerful as a nation. That does what well, I was born in America. Um, I have parents who were born in America, um, so I don't have, a, and I, I was relatively lucky in just sort of, you know, my circumstances and um, where I came from, so I don't have as much of the experience of like coming from nothing into something, but I do think that my life has been made very easy by being an American. I have had a lot of freedom to decide who I wanted to be and what I wanted to do. Um, I've managed to travel really freely amongst other countries, um, and that's a great privilege that I'm grateful for.